Hello, I'm Emily and I would love to introduce you to Codebox. Codebox is an electronic lock box that allows you to generate a new code for every visit. You're able to remotely generate codes either from your computer or your phone with our mobile friendly website or the app. Codebox is great for realtors, property managers, vacation renters, or really even a homeowner. Anybody can use Codebox as all you need to get into the box is the four digit code. The advantage of these one-time use codes is that they're going to expire two hours after it is utilized in the lockbox. So if somebody arrives to your property at 2.05, the lockbox knows that their code is expired at 4.05. You do not get to choose the times, but when they get to the box and punch in that code, it's going to expire two hours later. Another advantage of code box is for realtors that may be in two in between two different associations. So if you have one association using Supra and the other realtors aren't, they may not be able to get into that Supra box. So if your agent has a code box on the door, anybody can get into that box with their one-time use code. Another advantage to code box is the fact that we're a standalone company. While we're more than happy to work with MLSs or associations and we're able to create contracts, you don't have to have a contract with us. You can order one box or 20 just through our website whenever you need. Oftentimes, people assume that Codebox requires Wi-Fi or Bluetooth at the property because they're generating new codes. However, the lockbox itself does not need any Wi-Fi or Bluetooth. The boxes are pre-programmed with 16 one-time use codes for each day. When you generate a code, it's pulling from these pre-programmed codes. Here at Codebox, we currently sell two different sized boxes. We have the Codebox Junior and the Codebox Original or Senior. Functionally, they're exactly the same. The only difference between the two is the size of the key compartment. So this here is the Codebox Junior, and as you can see, it has a pretty small key slot. It's able to fit two to three single keys lying flat. The Codebox Original or Senior has a much bigger key slot. This is the Codebox Original. And it can fit a key ring with multiple keys, a fob, a business card here. Um, it's just a much bigger option. So that is the key slot. Both code boxes run just off of a standard 9 volt battery. There's no charging devices or anything needed. If your code box is in, on the door and it dies, there's an external port here where you're able to plug in this 9 volt battery. That's going to give it enough battery to open the box and change the 9 volt battery. As the owner of a code box, you'll have a few different codes. You're going to have a six digit admin code, a five digit shackle code, and a five digit vendor code. The admin code is going to allow you to change parameters of your box. We recommend keeping this code to yourself as the owner. It's going to allow you to change the date and time, it will allow you to change the shackle code and vendor code, and it will allow you to change the showing window. So if you only want people to be able to open your code box from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. or 9 to 5, whatever you choose, this is where you're able to change that with your admin code. You'll also have a vendor code. This is a nice option as you can give this code to trusted employees and they're able to get, get in when they need. So this is going to be a five digit static code. Right now my admin code is one, two, three, four, five. And it just allows you to open the box. You cannot change parameters with this code. Lastly, you'll have your shackle code. This is another five digit code and this is how you get the black box on and off the properties. So this is how you open the shackle here. And this is how you would place it on a door. Additionally, you're going to have your one-time use codes, and next I'll show you how you're able to generate those codes from your account. As the owner of our code box, you'll have a few different options in ways that you're able to manage them. On our website, you'll see a list of partners who are able to help you do that, or you can choose to manage your boxes from your account on our website. This is where you log into your account. This is going to be your self-serving portal, so you'll have all of your boxes listed within your account. So here you have all of your boxes with their serial numbers, and you're able to rena rename them to the current property they're on. So when someone calls, this is where you'll generate your one-time use code. So for example, 
will say somebody called to schedule an appointment at 123 Main Street. This is a serial number and it's currently active so you're able to generate a code. You can do it for today or for the future. So if someone wants to call for next week, we can do it here. Here's where you'll pick your date. So we'll go with Wednesday, April 10th. Next. And this is where you can record the showing. So this is where you enter the person's information to keep within your account. You wanna put their cell phone number here so that you're able to text them the code. When you click record showing get code, it's going to hold this, ag this agent's information in your account under this serial number. So you'll know who you gave this code to, or you can just get a code and it won't record that information. So we'll go here. So 8821 is your one time use four digit code for April 10th, 2019. 8821 is only going to work on that day. When they arrive at the property, it'll expire two hours later. Here you can send the code via text right to the agent. So if you go back to your dashboard and click on that serial number, 123 Main Street, we'll see all of the codes we've ever given for this property. So you can see on 41, we requested a code for 410. It's 8821 and we gave it to Emily. So that's how you generate the one-time use codes within your Codebox account. As far as pricing, we currently sell the Codebox Junior for $42 and the Codebox Original or Senior for $54. This is a one-time purchase cost and you own these boxes, you're not renting them. The only additional small fee is going to be the code generation fee. So to generate those codes that I just showed you on your account, you'll pay $1.25 per box per month. So now that you have a basic understanding of Codebox, please feel free to reach out with any additional questions or if you'd like to place an order, you can go to codeboxinc.com. Hopefully it will be your new favorite lockbox and we hope to hear from you soon. Thanks, bye.